Okay. Hey, now <laughs> we have many questions for you. <laughs> um, how did you feel on that home run? What did you see on that pitch? And how did it feel running around the bases like that for the first time in a, a few weeks? I mean, it's always it's great to hit a homer. Uh, I mean, I know all, all the players in the big leagues and Marlins everywhere, if they hit a homer, they, it feels great. So it just feels great. Uh, a long time, they don't get that feeling to hit that ball that hard and just run around the bases. It just feel great to be to be like that and hit a homer again. It's a great feeling. What was the difference in that at bat compared to some other at bats that hadn't resulted in home runs lately? I mean, it's just kind of the same. Uh, we all, all we've been working the last couple of days, just trying to put the ball in the air, <clears throat> try to hit the ball square up and put it in the air. It's, it's coming through right now and it feel great. How important was it to have a good night at the plate, um, everybody on the team after Strasburg exited the game? Uh, uh, I think it's, it's great. Uh, it will uh, help me feel a little bit mentally to him uh, to don't feel like he, he left the team behind. Uh, I think it's, it's a good team, not just not just for Strass, you know, it's, it, it, for for everybody, for the whole team. Everybody start feeling great, start hitting the ball square up. I think it, it was a great game. Thank you. Hey Juan, um, tonight of your hits, what do you want to take from those at bats? into the next game and build on? What is like maybe the one thing you thought really went well for you tonight? We hit the ball to the other way. Uh, I think <clears throat> that's, that, that was the key that has got me set it up. Uh, when I hit that single to the left field, it just got me really on and really ready for it. Is that letting it travel in the zone a bit more? Like, is that when you're in your comfort spot? Yeah, kind of, uh, you know, the freeze kind of tough. He been trying to throw me a couple quarters, quarters that I don't know if he knows he he been throwing that. Uh, but yeah, it feels it feels good to go in that way and just let it travel a little bit more and see a little bit deeper. And then once you once you get that single to the other way, does your what's that do for your confidence? What's that do for your rhythm at the plate for the for the coming at bats? Oh, he just. Like I say, he set everything up uh, for the next at bats. Uh, <clears throat> he got me on time. He, he showed me where I can hit the ball, where how how far I can let it travel, and how good I can hit it anywhere on the plate. Juan well, Trey, Trey had three more hits tonight. What impresses you most about what he does at the plate and what he's done this year? I mean, it just <clears throat> the way he swings the bat is amazing, uh, and how skinny he is and how hard he hit the ball. <laughs> <laughs> he's impressive. Uh, he just, it's just great to see him hitting like that and just run around the bases with his speed and all that kind of stuff. It's just, it's just great to, to enjoy it and see how, how he plays baseball. How does he get so much power, even though he is skinny? I don't know, man. I just, I've been thinking and I've been asking him about it. And he just said he got to hit the ball on the ground. But I'm like, you don't hit the ball on the ground anymore. <laughs> <laughs> so, right, he doesn't. <laughs> so he's just he's just impressive. Thanks, man. Hola, Juan. Eh, tengo un par de preguntas. How did you feel today in the turns at bat? Quiero quiero saber cómo te sentiste hoy en en los turnos al bate. Se te notó más paciente. Me gustaría saber cómo cómo te sentiste. Lo voy a traducir. Yeah. Ok. Uh, <coughs> me sentí muy bien eh, en el plato. Eh, vi los lanzamientos muy bien. Eh, me sentí bien cómodo. Todo el trabajo que hemos hecho lo, los últimos días creo que están dando resultados y me sentí muy bien hoy. I felt good at the plate. I felt good with my at bats. Uh, I'm starting to see a lot of the, the fruit of my labor with uh, working with the, uh, with the staff, coaching staff. Uh, the work's paying off. So that's good to see. Y justamente siguiendo ese orden de ideas, ¿has estado trabajando en algo específico para, para mejorar el bateo? Uh, have you been working specifically on anything to improve your hitting? Claro, eh, como dije, hemos tratado de 
poner la bola en el aire, tratar de, de, de golpear, tener buenos contactos. Hemos tenido varios buenos contactos, pero más poner la bola en el aire y ver qué tan lejos puede caer. Uh, eso es lo que hemos trabajado en los últimos días, eh, tratar de sacar esa maceta adelante y ver cómo la bola camina en el aire. Yes, absolutely. I've been trying to lift the ball a little bit more, make hard contact as usual. But uh, in the last few days, it's been more of a focus of, of trying to get my bad head out in front and uh, get some lift behind the ball and uh, basically carry, carry a little bit more. Gracias, Juan. Thank you. Hey, Juan. When opposing fans chant, Things at you? I mean, does that motivate you at all more, or do you not even notice what, what they're saying? Well, Juan, cuando los fanáticos te gritan cosas, uh, te motiva más en el sentido, yo creo, cosas negativas. No explico, pero me imagino que cosas negativas te, te motiva más para, para jugar allá. What kind of things? I think they chanted overrated today from, from the stands, but before you kind of broke out of, uh, with the home run singles, things like that. Uh, I mean, Every time we're in the road, uh, I know I get a lot of stuff in the right field. They talk a lot, of, a lot of things down there. I just try to pay attention to the game. Sometimes they just make me laugh. Uh, I don't go. I don't care what they say. I just really concentrate on the game. Uh, I just try to enjoy the game and do whatever I can. Every every negative comment, I just try to pull it out of my head and just keep it forward in the game. Thanks, man.